Why did you run, Kiernan? I was the last one to see Evelyn that night. I knew you would think it was me. Wait, I gotta take a second to remember who this guy is. The fellow bowling. Uh, no, the fellow that was on top of the building. What? I think. Oh, I'm not sure. Wait, let's just take a second. What do they say? Oh, uh, just view the notebook. Can you go back? Uh. Doubt it. Sounds like half an answer to me, Terry. Nah, it's wrong. Were you sleeping with her? That's none of your business. Rolling Stoli Alley. Oh, that's right. Okay, I remember now. Yep. Kathy started looking at it once and laughed in her face. You're saying Evelyn stole it. She wanted something of his. Truth. You don't like McCaffrey, do you, Turner? He's full of the common man routine, but he props up a bar like the rest of us. Evelyn thought he was going to be a great novelist. Oh, McCaffrey's the fellow we interviewed in the bar. The writer. Oh, shit. You and Evelyn were drinking together last night. And she had no other place to stay. I don't know what happened last night. I, I don't remember. Uh, we need to view the notebook. Because I got no idea what's going on right yeah, now. Yeah, me neither. I say lie. You're lying, Tyrion. You've been fighting with her. You fought. And I'm not lying. She got up and left. That was it. Okay. Now what? So I have a feeling. Oh, go up to like purchase. I'm feeling torn letter, maybe. Don't talk about how it was between oh. Evelyn. You don't know anything. We are on a roll. <laughs> We're you not doing so well. Tyrion. No, I don't. Have access to a lug wrench? No, we use a lot of them. To clear jams in the pin setting machines. Okay. Truth. Evelyn was beaten to death with a lug wrench. We found the wrench at McCaffrey's apartment. You see? It was McCaffrey. He had nothing but hatred for me and Evelyn. I think I had a feeling he set him up. We literally failed everything. She always wore it. Black circular disc with a white E in the middle. It was making a little typewriter key, present from the prop department at her old movie studio. We want to talk to McCaffrey. You need to think about what you've told us, Tiernan. You're not in the clear. I think it's him. Tiernan. I think he set up McCaffrey. Because it was from the bowling alley. Yeah. I think he's trying to set him up because he doesn't like McCaffrey and he doesn't want because he thought. Evelyn liked McCaffrey and he wanted them out of business. Answer some questions. You think I have all the answers? People who run from the police usually have something to hide. Touche, detective. Let's see where this takes us. You told us you barely knew Evelyn Summers. She hung around sometimes. Who is this tap dancing person? <laughs> we gotta stop talking. When someone in the background is just like, bam. I'm just gonna say doubt. Doesn't look good. Though. It's either you or Tiernan from where we're sitting. Personally, I think Evelyn is better off, but I had nothing to do with it. Yeah, fail. Evelyn died sometime around midnight. Remind me, where were you? I was at home, writing. I'm working on a manuscript. He's lying, but I don't know how to tell. Oh. I don't think we have any clues to say. They ought to You're going to need to do better if you don't want to swing for this. I was having a political meeting in my apartment. Cheese and crackers for the fifth columnist. Some of these people will corroborate your story. I won't give up names of party members. Good. Your funeral. It's either gonna be you. We're doing shit. The more I'm doing shit. Stick detective. The party has good lawyers. Uh, 
Okay. Wow. What so, a failure. So, um, to the, to the phone then. I'm really not doing good. Operator, give me dispatch. I'm starting to think the this... The problem with this game is that when you start to get tired, your mind doesn't work properly, and then you really do fail. Yeah. Like, you need to listen properly. I think the two people playing this particular game is enough. It might not be the, be the best fit ever. <laughs> oh. Thanks. Okay. Right here, let's bring that up. You were in the war? Yes, I was. Seeing the things that I saw, it changes a man. I came back here determined to change things. All I wanted was a pen, an opportunity to speak out. You told us before that you had only minor run-ins with the police. You didn't mention petty theft. I've never been in trouble for violence. That's the salient point here, isn't it? Lying. Lie. You're lying, McCaffrey. You have a history of violence towards women. How do you turn a couple parking tickets in a petty theft misdemeanor into an assault charge? Caffrey's criminal record. Uh, assault. Yeah. We know all about you and your dishonorable discharge. Beating some poor woman here to death in Syracuse. You've never been in combat, McCaffrey. Your whole life is a fraud. She was a goddamn peasant whore! She tried to steal from my wallet. I could have... Fought for this country! I could have... You beat her because she stole from you. Because she tried to outsmart you. The ignorant audacity of the bitch! What is a man supposed to do? Sit there and take it? How is a man supposed to call himself a man? And Evelyn Summers, a poor, drunken nobody, stole your book. And she got what was coming to her! Oh! There's no reason we have to do it right away, right? Leave interrogation for the moment. That's interesting, actually. That I like how this game, even when you do so shitty like we have been, sometimes you get these right it, little It just moments. it makes it makes you do something. Yeah. Like, okay, what else have we got? We got any locations we can go to? No. Lose. You're right, there is arson there. Yeah. Um, go back. We can only go to Central Police Station. Alright, let, let's... We should review the clues. We should see what everything's saying. Um, well, I want to I wanna interview... I don't think we can review him again. We can interview him again. I think we can. I just want to see what he just says. I've had my say. Yeah, he's anymore. done. Oh yeah. Okay, so. What they got to say? What do you think? Put the heat to one of them, Phelps. Your choice. I think I'm just gonna go with McCaffrey. Oh. He seems pretty fishy, and he seems like he's got that anger issue. I don't know if it's him, but I do honestly think it's the other person. Though. There's no, there's no way we can. I do honestly think it's the other guy. But there's no way we can pursue the other guy. Yeah. Like we screwed that up. Big Shit. Um, so I think we kind of just have to, we have to go with, um, with McCaffrey. I think so. Yeah, this is yeah, done. we can't charge him. Shit, right. that's gay. Right, yeah, we'll just charge McCaffrey. The <laughs> We're the worst horrible detectives. Yeah. We'll just charge him because it's the only one we know of. Eh. McCaffrey, I'm charging you with the murder of Evelyn Summers. She was a sad lady. Never heard anyone except Congratulations, boys, you bagged the fine patch. Another red to boot. Grant. Now, I want you to put this business about a repeat offender out of your mind. This McCaffrey creature shows no remorse, and neither will the grand jury. You would have to walk a long mile to find a better candidate for an unmarked part in the prison graveyard. I don't... He's not the killer, though. He's not the one that's doing it to all these people. 
Oh, well, that's definitely true. Mm, we still haven't found There was no footprints in this one, though. So it was kind of hard to... Yeah. Wow. That's not good. <laughs> Five thousand we did, we did vehicle damage. We did okay for clues. Yeah. Not, not so much, not so much for the questions. Not, not, not completely. I want to go to arson. Can we, we go to soon. Can we go to arson. Oh. Yeah. Ooh. Okay. We have lost most of Shauna's here done squad. His gunny is dead, first platoon is in worse shape. That medic is either crazy or the bravest man alive. Now we round him with the first, and try for the man boot. It's here to the left. To the right, it goes right through a pass with two man boots and inflate. Maybe we can lose that everyone. Shit doesn't get it. Get back off this fucking bridge. They'll start walking the orders back to their own positions. We only have I'm minutes. in charge here, Sergeant. Get your men off the bridge, Lieutenant. What's your unit, Sergeant? We don't have time for this, Lieutenant. What's your unit, Sergeant? I company 22nd Marines, Lieutenant. And we just saved your ass by boarding the river. My orders are to reconnoiter the... I think that point is now moot. You have 10 minutes left. My orders are to save what's left. Move out! Mmm. Love that smooth, refreshing taste <laughs> of Schweppes lemonade. You know, I, I really love how like it just it just it just tastes the way you want it to taste well, every time. <laughs> well, we have a problem. The examiner received a new letter today. You mind if I take a look, Ray? Go right ahead. They've both been rinsed in gasoline, like the previous letters, so oh. I can't lift the print. Okay. No one else but the killer knew about this message. Cunt BD, find, find me where, me where I, I hid myself. myself. Looking in wonder up to heaven, Another while yet the music peels along, I hid myself within a fountain in the public square where I lay like the reflex of the moon, seen in a wave under green leaves. Wave under green leaves. Poetic works of Percy Bysshe Shelley. Hmm. Suffer woes, which hope thinks infinite. Give wrongs darker than death. Right. Power. Fire power, which seems, seems omnipotent. <laughs> <laughs> to love and bear, to hope till hope creates from its own wreck the thing it contemplates. Neither to change nor falter nor repent. This, like thy glory, Titan, is to be good, great, and joyous, beautiful, and free. This is alone, life, joy, empire, and victory. Sweet! So beautiful. The note is from the Dahlia Maniac. He definitely also killed Teresa Terrell. Now and I agree, but where does that leave us? If this is the Dahlia killer, and he is responsible for the Tarleton murder, not to mention the Molotov... Hang on a moment, Skipper. Let me finish, Rusty. We have five birds in hand and none in the bush. The department will not survive a scandal if you have to let them all go without catching a fiend first. Your careers will be over for a start, Jim. Looking in wonder... Ah, oh, fuck it. I knew this run was too good to be true. I hid myself within a fountain public square. You like that stuff? What is it supposed to mean? It's supposed to... Forget what it's supposed to... What does he want? Where are you going with this, Tom? He's obviously taunting us. He believes he's far more intelligent than we are. Okay. It's some kind of story, right? A guy that... Oh, shut the fuck up, Rusty. <laughs> allegory, Rusty. A story with two meanings. A symbolic meaning. But that's what he wants us to think. Could he be using it literally? Within a fountain in a public square? Could be that easy. Can somebody tell me what the fuck is going on? Square. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, we have a clue. Captain? Thanks, Ray. Be careful, Phelps. This is his game you're playing now.